Hello everyone, you know some footballers enjoy a rainy day, not sure fans always feel that way, but an exciting match in prospect nonetheless. This is Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon, and very excited to be able to bring you live action from League Two coming up. It's Mansfield Town taking on Colchester United. I'm excited Derek, really looking forward to this game, come on bring it on. So the initial 11 for the home side. What do you think about this particular setup? Well, strikers like support, and they've got support today in the number 10. They've also got three midfield players behind, two slightly wide, and one just sitting in front of the back four. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. Two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. And now they get the ball rolling. Cook. McLaughlin. Gordon Cook McLaughlin Can Lloyd Sherrod, that's Lloyd Sherrod Please make yourself known to the nearest two. Thank Perfectly you. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Good idea, that particular move, but not to be. Read it well. What can they do from here? It just needs to remain icy cool. It's opening up for them. Fruitful looking attack. Oh, great vision. Not far away at all with the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got to have really good technique. And oh, so close. Courtney Senior Smith Tommy Smith It's with Tom Eastman Harry Pell Well, showing good patience. Eastman. It's with Pell. 
in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Read it superbly to take back possession. He's protecting it effectively. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Cook. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Far from a good pass. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Didn't quite go to plan. That's a routine take. Harry Pell. What can he do from here? See some progress with the ball at his feet. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, you might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Lee. Well, no goals for him, no real chances either. He needs to help his team a little bit more just to get involved in the game. I think he would be the difference if he was playing better. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Unable to keep the ball that time. Careless in possession. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Real chance! And a wonderful save. All types of save keepers make, but that's really important. Look how close the striker gets. Corner kick played in. Goalkeeper's ball. It was always going to be that way. Jordan Bowery. That's a good-looking ball. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Jordan Bowery. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot straight at him. No problem for the goalie. When you look at those stats, Derek, it tells a story all of its own. They haven't created enough chances. The forwards have been off the game as well. They haven't really utilised the wide areas for me. But they should go on and win the game, to be honest. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Can he put them in front? Surely! And able to get a body in the way.
Well, there to intercept. Smith. Well, the attack looks promising. Courtney Senior. Senior. Excellent ball over the top. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. McLaughlin. Cook. Only ten minutes remaining here. Cook. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. Tremendous ball played through. And they've only gone and applied that finishing touch. Well, the offside flag has been raised. No goal. Well, it was close, but he just went a little bit too early. Substitution time as is here. Well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. Cook. And the ball's gone. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Getting in there to intercept. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes.